Hello everybody, this is PhD Monoxide here, and today I'm going to be showing you how to, uh, well, unlock or decrypt uh, a locked file. Uh, in this video I'm going to be showing you how to do it on Modern Warfare 2 uh, DLL files. Uh, it's really easy, you just need a few, you need these programs here, uh, you don't really need these two, but you will need a patch of your choice. This is just to show you an example of that is locked. Uh, so yeah, I'm not going to put these in the description yet because they're all over the internet. You'll find them really easy. And uh, this is for JTAGs only, so there's no point people without JTAGs trying it. But you can still watch the video anyway. Uh, so what you need to do is get your patch like that you've chose. I've chosen Rusty Mods. It's quite a good one. Uh, you just put it on your desktop like that. Uh, and what you do, just to prove that it's locked, I'll open it with DLL Creator and it will say something like, let it load up actually I'll load it up uh, so yeah, find it on your desktop name like Alter, just like A, yeah, there it is uh, when it opens, it's invalid.dll file uh, when it's not actually uh, invalid so yeah, that just proves that it's locked so now what you want to do is open up CMD. Uh, I've got mine already open, but yeah. So basically, before you start this, you need to make sure that you've got XEX tool uh, and your patch and CMD on the desktop. Otherwise, there's no point doing it. And you just type in XEX tool space E U space space U and then after this you want to press space again and pr type in the name of the patch in this case it is Alter Infinity Ward 4 so you just have to make sure that the, it's the exact capitals and everything so yeah type that in and then you hit enter and this will come up and it says successfully wrote altered XTX to Alter whatever the DLL is and it says alter infinity wood for main.dll is dev kit unencrypted uncompressed and yeah so basically that file is now unlocked so you uh, drag it into a hxd editor and this is basically where you can it's really easy to do and the shortcut to find the start well the start of the bits that you can edit just control f and type in something like game and okay and it starts somewhere it, uh, you won't get it from the start but it starts like for example uh, I saw sort of, I think I lost it now but yeah it's just somewhere here just copy and paste like parts of it up until say example there just copy and then if you open a notepad and you can just paste it in like that and you can like edit say where it says love rusty lobby but pht once you're done you highlight or copy the whole thing and while that's still highlighted you click paste right and it will like change and you hit save up there I'm just gonna I don't really want to save that and now this one here is like your custom one so you can now put that onto your USB Put it onto XEX menu and load up your custom game mode and have fun on it. Oh, some temp lobbies. Um, so yeah, this is basically a short tutorial on how to uh, decrypt locked files, like .dll files. I hope you liked it, and I'm out.